Yay! How did I end up here? Alone? I am unsure. But have hope, Arya. You have proven yourself very capable. Once you rewind Earth, you could safely return home if you so desire. I hope so. And what about you? What are you gonna do? I'm not sure what my purpose is if there are no puzzles to operate and manage. I guess... I may like to see what exists outside the Entropy Center. You should come too. Earth can be nice, from what I remember. Yes. I think I would like that. Yeah, maybe we can get you set up in like a proper body too. Oh jeez, okay. How the hell are we gonna do this? Alright, this is... this is definitely very multi-staged. Um, Right, launch it. Okay. And then if I do this. Gives us a lift, but why? Oh, a secret second queue. Okay, I get you. I needed it to. <laughs> ah! No, I fucked up. I was supposed to keep it going. just panicked. I was like... Oh! <laughs> I probably could have done some other shenanigans with this cube and just had them both there. But we, we, we got it. Uh, hey! We still don't know what the fuck's going on with that. Oh, there's a lot of them. I touched it! I touched it. Why did they leave? Rewind Earth! Rewind the cataclysmic event! Oh boy. Earth Reversal 9283. This is an automated message. Please do not reply. To Jericho. Unfortunately, the Entropy Center has rewound Earth to a date that is before your date of birth. 20th, July 1999. This now means that unfortunately you will be unable to return to Earth due to potential duplicate person. We thank you for your service and sacrifice to the Entropy Center. 
please call Maisie 99 or 900 201 3459 to sign up for emotional support and well being class. Thank you. You can no longer go back to Earth because you already exist there again. But hey, <laughs> you can talk to someone if you want. But damn. So they rewinded Earth all the way back to before 1999 on the 9,283rd Earth reversal. Because <laughs> beforehand, every most of their things were like, hey, we're, we're, we're jumping back five years. So why did they jump back what must have been way further? Whoa. Holy shit. Reactor core spotted. Directive. Head to the reactor control panel. Are those puzzles next to the reactor? That's not good. And maybe when this thing blows up, bad things happen. Maybe it's blown up in the past. Okay, it's not a puzzle area, it's a fighting area. It's a chase and fight sequence, probably. Bye bye Whoa, okay. You know, these are useful. All right, maybe we're just going. Okay, no, 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 no. We do need to reverse it. Back to its starting position. <laughs> if only I could super rewind. That was a dangerous time for that to be launched. Jeez. Do I have to blow up something? Oh, oh. Good thing I looked up. Oh boy. Save this facility, you stupid robots! Leave me alone! Oh boy. Ooh. No, I, I think I will just keep it like this. Thank you very much. Keep it stable! We're almost there! Surely we've got the edge spot and the entropy energy for this! Hey, I can target that. <laughs> Hopefully I don't need to reverse time on it. Oh boy. Whoa. 
What? Oh yeah? I don't know if we can do that! But I guess we can just rewind it enough that it's stable! That sounds like a lot of radiation hitting us. Know this was gonna happen. Entropy reactor core is now stable. Entropy device can now be activated. Oh shit! Yeah, that makes sense. The path has collapsed. Oh shit! Whoa! Things are going forward and backwards down here. Holy shit. What do we got down here? The cavern. Hey Marvin! Have you been down in the, into the cavern beneath the reactor recently? It's super creepy down there, and I think I saw something? No wonder it has turned into a pit of dumping ground. Or, no wonder it has turned into a bit of a dumping ground. No one wants to go down there. I heard the puzzle operative team were considering using the area to create some new puzzle areas, but decided against it due to the unstable terrain. For all Entropy Center members, please note that the Entropy Reactor has entered a fail-safe self-repair mode. When in this state, the reactor will emit a rewind pulse at regular intervals. This will repair damage supports and structural elements close to the reactor core to increase overall reactor structural integrity. This has been automatically enabled due to the reactor reversal state triggered by unauthorized personnel. All entropy staff must vacate the cavern and reactor area when this state is enabled. Oh <laughs> yeah? You just, you just want me to run? I can do that. Should I hide behind the pillars when that happens? I feel like I should hide behind the pillars when that happens, but nothing's happening to me so far. So like, that's... kind of good. Order, one, two, four. Hey Jim, engineering has just made a request for an additional 800 kilogram of moon rock excavation to be turned into concrete. You think maybe we may be able to turn this over in a couple of weeks? They're needing it to build a new structure around puzzle area 16. Dave, or thanks, Dave. Puzzle area 16? Yeah, we do still have quite a bit of intel to go, and now we're all the, all the way down here. These must be the really advanced puzzle areas. Where's my gun? Maybe, maybe Astra is still functional. As much as I appreciate Astra trying to self-sacrifice for me, There's still more to do. This mission isn't done. E. Hey, do you know how to get out of here? Have you seen Astra? Okay then. Follow the weird robot it is. 
Thank you, E. I was taking a drink of water. Apparently they opened the door for us. I'll just take this back up. Aha! So many logs in this area. Expansion zone. Hey, oh, Jonathan. Regarding our conversation last week about creating a new set of puzzle areas, what about the zone just underneath the reactor? Section 10B, I think it is? There's loads of space there. Hey, Brennan. Nah, that area isn't gonna work. I think we tried building some stuff there a while back, but it just didn't work out. The terrain is way too unstable. It's become a bit of a dumping ground. Also, it's way too risky being that close to the reactor. Maybe we could expand onto the beaches instead? I think the puzzle operatives wouldn't mind catching some rays whilst doing the puzzles. It was nice being by the beaches versus being by an exploding super core. Hey. Just checking on us? Oh, I guess, yeah, we'll go that way. Reverse it! Pick us up! Oh shit! Whoa! Whoa! Okay! <laughs> well, thankfully... A jump pad fell down here at some point, I guess. <sighs> I was about to say, more logs? Jeez! Damn it. There's a button I have to press? How the hell do I manage that? Ah, uh, Sneaky! Good here? Do I have to do anything? Huh. We're good. Although we really are kind of getting to some excavation area. Jeez. This isn't safe. Cataclysm research. Is this where we're going to get some answers? Real answers as to what the hell's going on? It turns out rewinding time over and over and over again fucks with the universe. Hey. You know I have no idea what you're saying, right? We can make guesses. It responds with nuclear uh, nuclear annihilation. Is that this the specific subsection of this area? Particular cataclysm. Uh, nuclear annihilation for everything. We study the effects of what could happen. Turns out that big giant bombs make big bad explosions. Oh no. I just figured that somewhere along the staircase would be safe. That was not the point. That was safe. Alright, so this ramp here is safe. Or catwalk, rather. That ramp is safe. I was so close to being, like, where I should be. We died, like, right here. Ooh. <laughs> My head. This is why they make you wear hard hats. Jeez. 
Well, plenty of documents, nothing for me to read. Oh no. I got, I got stuck on the staircase. I don't know how the heck that happened. How are you just bumping her legs? Oh, this place is stable, all right. People are sleeping down here? Was it the nuclear cataclysms taking the world out? They had to go overtime on that. <laughs> Guys, don't use a thousand nukes. It will destroy the world. Oh gosh, they're not listening. Cataclysm number 13,467. AKA the one that we're currently dealing with. All right. Give us some info. Cataclysm recurrence. And cataclysm. Uh, so this is showing how many times a cataclysm event has occurred. And in comparison to any other event, like some events did happen more than once. Although one of the things suggested that wasn't the case. I, I don't know. Strategies, cataclysms that data sent to earth. Rewound Earth further back, a hundred years, informed Earth the severity of cataclysm. Urgent appeal sent to governing body. What next? A hundred years? From when? We were in the 2030s and 2040s. <laughs> so they went all the way back to like a World War II kind of era world? Or I guess like... A little bit around that time or just after, geez. Well, if the problem was, uh... Us using entropy energy in the first place, going back a hundred years and continuing to use entropy energy probably wasn't ideal. I have to make a jump here. On that one. Huh. Whew. Leap of faith. But damn, man, if you went back a hundred years, proved that you were time travelers trying to save the world, and they still didn't listen to your ass to prevent this, that's crazy. But that. It implies that we know what causes this problem. This doesn't seem like a problem. That, uh... Let's do this. Oh, shit! What the fuck was that? Okay, so now they're timed, they're timed explosions. Oh, oh, right, I don't have my fucking... Oh, I forgot. I don't have the ability to reverse time. Can I still toss their asses? Nope. Hey. Knock it off. Boom! Oh boy. Hey, how come you get the easy way? Oh no. <laughs> oh, what a bounce! Oh shit. No, 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 no. Ah! 
This is why ex handling explosives should be left to the experts. That's not me. Beam me up. Still, what the hell happened, everyone, then? So we, we try and travel back a hundred years. Jeez, that was a far one. Oh, I went too soon! Whoa! This seems like a problem. A, a, a permanent problem. <laughs> I, well... Permanent problems need permanent solutions, I guess. Jeez. It's alright! We time traveled! Whoa, that, okay. <laughs> the screen got real blurry there. Do I have motion blur? Hold on, I haven't really been paying attention. I guess... There's a little bit of motion blur. Alright. I got punished for being super preemptive. I just gotta wait. Seems at least we're making some distance from the shittier part of underneath the reactor. Now let's hope there's a fast track elevator up. I didn't really learn shit from the Cataclysm research area, that's a little disappointing. Uh... Oh, is this- is this it? The dramatic reveal of information? No, it's- fuck you. Are you serious? It's just a door opening computer. 53 of 76 intel collected. Um, there was no intel there. Oh, who messed that up? <laughs> you had one job! Jeez. That doesn't sound good. Oh. Oh no. Are we in an infinite looping room? This one doesn't have the lights. Fifty-three seventy-six Intel collected. Haha. <laughs> Why? What's happening? To all Entropy Center staff, as you all know, the ongoing recurring cataclysmic event has been of deep concern to us here at the Entropy Center. Our humanitarian and prosperous progress in being a gatekeeper for Earth's timeline seems to have met an unfortunate and unsettling block. Unfortunately, our hands are tied. If Earth cannot correct their course on the timeline, then we will simply meet the same outcome of the timeline. No matter how much data we send to Earth, or how many times we rewind Earth. Please note that we are in ongoing and complex talks with the world leaders on Earth in an aim to put a stop to this seemingly endless loop that we're going through. We greatly appreciate all your hard work during this unsettling time. Take care all, Tom. All right, maybe we are gonna get the information about this place. Yeah, that's gotta be rough. Cause they time traveled a hundred years. It's probably, Right? Like, it had to have gotten even worse. Because then they were dealing with people who were like, Oh, we've got time travelers from the future? What the hell? Versus, you know, the people who actually helped make their facility. Let's see. Please find attach the auto-generated rewind log of reversal number two, uh, 22,457. One, cataclysmic event spotted. Success. Entropy device charged. Success. Entropy device enabled. Success. 
Earth rewound five years prior. Success. Uh, data sent to Earth. Earth corrects projected course on timeline. Failed. Yeah, we definitely we got that. All oh, the place is getting more and more decayed. But to be fair, the whole place has been super decayed. Dear puzzle operatives, due to the current unfortunate events surrounding the ongoing cataclysmic event, the Entropy Center is enforcing a six-day work week to increase our entropy yield during these unsettling times. We understand this may be frustrating for a lot of you. Please understand that your hard work is extremely appreciated. Kind regards. Ellie Boldner, Evac. Hey, Arya, where are you? We're down by the transport base. Are you coming? We don't have much longer to wait. Oh, uh, shit. An actual email being sent to us. So they evacuated on September 19th of whatever date or year that was. Whoa. Whoa. How many times have I been here? Solve puzzles. You've been here before. Oh jeez, all the images of Earth. How does the world end? Why does it keep happening? Why does it keep happening? To all Entropy Center staff, please note that the Entropy Center has now entered a lockdown state and is preparing for the launch of the evacuation transport base. Many thanks, Entropy Center Automated System. So did I stay just to like try and stop all this? How long, how many times have I been doing this? Your office. This is my office? Oh shit. Because we had to rewind our minds so many times. Why did they leave? Why did they leave? Rewind the cataclysmic event. This isn't real. Well. So these are all after images of myself imprinted on time. Which is what I kind of expected. But I was also wondering if it was going to be... Maybe other people. Why do they leave? Why is Earth on fire? I stay. I why? What is the? What? Is, what happened? Aria, I don't see you. Are you on the evacuation ship? We're about to leave. Please come quickly. I know you were really shaken up about all this, but we can't do anything now. The center's on the brink of collapse. You won't be able to do anything on your own. I won't be coming, Ellie. I'm sorry, but I have to stay. This is an entropy center automated message. The entropy center has now been evacuated via evacuation bay. The facility has now entered an automated lockdown state. Oh, shit, though. If they evacuated to Earth, and we still managed to rewind time, they might have been affected, obviously, by the rewind of Earth, and they might have been... rewinded almost out of existence? I mean, they had traveled a hundred years into the past. Did they wait the hundred years? And then go back? Did they just go down to Earth before then? Doesn't that cause problems? Find Astra. Loop number nine 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 one. Rewind Earth, solve puzzles, find Astra, fix reactor. Note to self Dear Arya, I think this might be the end for me. I found and lost a really helpful companion who was with me during all the puzzle exercises. I can't really continue without her. I'm stuck beneath the reactor with all exits broken 
I have no way to escape. I've commandeered an office where I can maybe start some research, and perhaps I can find an escape route. If I can maybe find the cause of the recurring cataclysmic event, I can find a way to stop it. But how many times did we lose Astra? Whoa. Well, here they're showing, you know, like, trash from humanity. Then they're just showing kind of like a little bit of climate change and disasters. Is this like a super pessimistic thing? Like, humanity just can't change their ways. They always end in cataclysm. They just don't know how to stop themselves from destroying the world. Wake up, this isn't real. Fix a reactor, rewind Earth, wake up, find Astra, solve puzzles. I stay, why does it keep happening? Well, because we're not making progress. We're the, we still don't even know in this loop what the hell's going on? Wake up, Arya. Now. Ugh. Oh, I could try. Oh, is the water rising? Oh, shit. Let me out! Oh. It's so beautiful. It's intact. But what if I could just keep my memories? Whoa. Uh, Ebon. Hey. Oh, what was that? What's over there? You see something? Is that Astra? Is that Astra? I don't, I don't see shit. Oh, they're gonna try an incinerator! Oh shit! We gotta, we gotta pick it up! Okay, I can do this. It looks dangerous, so stay here, okay? <laughs> okay, that works too. Hey, now we've got two companions to help us out. I wonder how many times Arya lost her mind because we lost Astra. Give me my little robot friend back, you bastards! We could have been working together! But no! Instead, we have to fight. I'm gonna save this world. With or without your help. But I need Astra because I need I need emotional support during all this. They are a friend, the only friend we have left. Oh shit! Ah, uh, yeah. Fair enough that a shelf doesn't block that. I got the double kill there. 
wonder if there's any... I gotta keep an eye out. We need lore. Thank God the explosives don't set off the other explosives. Give me back my friend! Astra! I got you, buddy! Astra? Hello! Handheld entry device systems now online. <laughs> You're back. I was starting to think I lost you forever. I thought you had died. I missed you lots. I remember the reactor and then a painful tickling. Everything went dark. The next thing I remember, my systems were rebooting. Hey, ye. Your stress levels are at 87%. Did something happen? Kind of. I can't quite explain it. I was just worried. About me? <laughs> About a lot of things. You're pretty handy to have around, you know. New route detected. Let's head onwards, Arya. We only need to complete a few more puzzle areas before the entropy device is fully charged. All right, let's do it. It's good to have you back, Astra. Hell yeah. Whew. All right. Well, we saw that there's up to 16 puzzle areas. And last we left off, we had like 80% reactor charge. But who knows how that is now. But I'm glad we were able to get Astra back. But they do seem to be a little bit damaged. Hopefully, hopefully they'll be fine. We'll see. Detecting route. We are two areas away from the main control deck. Now that the reactor is stable, we just need to finish charging the entropy device by completing a few more puzzles. Got it. Ugh. Down there, I discovered a lot. I started to remember. How interesting. Please elaborate. I don't know. I don't think this is the first time we've been on this journey, Astra. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. I mean, it makes sense, right? From everything we've seen, everybody abandoned the place, and the only way to keep Earth from permanently being destroyed is for us to, et like, eternally loop back and fix things over and over and over again. We might have to go up to potentially 18 areas? Man. You know, I thought this was going to be like a four hour game. We're almost at the seven hour mark. But we are, you know, we're, we're, we're getting up there in terms of intel. Like again, I still feel like I'm going to miss out on some. Is it just going to open for me? Ooh, there's a dramatic view of Earth back there. Oh, there's a button. Aha! Yeah, I imagine... Oh, it's a reset button. Alright, I gotta set up spot down there. Jump spot here. And then we take this back up with us. Either we're going to legitimately go through six more puzzle areas. Or some things are going to be cut a little bit short. Like, oh, hey, we've got enough energy within like areas 14 and six, 15 and 16. Get us out of here. <laughs> Activate the reactor.
little bit of foosball. Spooky ghosts. Hey, Connor. So yeah, ghosts exist. I'm telling you, I've seen them. There used to be one in my house. Maybe not here, at EC, but on Earth? Definitely. I don't think anyone has proven it, but I'm sure. But I think I have a theory. I think when we rewind something too much or too often, previous timelines start to overlap with ours and we start seeing visions of the other unused timelines. I know it sounds a bit weird, but it makes sense, right? Yeah, it makes sense. That's a little fringe science though, don't you think? Fringe? Come on, man. We're on a tropical space hub on the moon. In a facility that you can rewind time on of Earth. And you're saying my ghost theory is too fringe? You make a good point. Beer? I'll be there in five. <laughs> Thank you, she got me there. We have been seeing different versions of ourselves. Whoa. Analyzing surface temperature. Surface temperature is 8,000 degrees Celsius. You could cook an egg from 20,000 miles away. Sheesh. Would it... Insensitive Astra. <laughs> would it be a... When you say cook an egg, do you mean completely atomize it from the heat? <laughs> or do you mean cook it at a safe to eat temperature? There's a bit of a difference there, and the word cook can still be used for both of them. But I'll assume Astro made the proper calculations. I don't think we're frying any eggs, though. Still, sheesh. Hell of a view. <laughs> HR was that way, wow. Alright, let's go up. Whoa. Woohoo. Little two up. Ecological research. Study area. We don't need those now. Now we just need puzzles. Warning. The following puzzle exercises are rated extremely hard. Sections 1, 2, 3, 4, and 8 of the Entropy Center are currently destroyed and not accessible. This is the fastest route. Okay then, let's do this. Sheesh. Alright, what, what are we working with here, puzzle element-wise? We've got... A jump block and a bridge block. Doesn't look like there's any transformers or fans or conveyor belts. Okay. Well, we've got three buttons. Obviously, I need to. Uh, See, I need to get the bridge up there. But let's see. Let me, let me need, I need a better view of everything. What are we doing? Okay, so I, I need to get the jump bridge up here too, actually. <laughs> okay, so let's start this off. Like this. All right, and we have to move the jump piece here. Jump up here with the bridge piece. Then we can move it down to here. Use time shenanigans. All right. Why 
mind this a little bit because we wasted some time there. Same with this. Okay. And this is the trouble spot. I guess what I'm supposed to do... is actually use the jump cube. Which thankfully I can just bring over. All right. <sighs> Good thing I was still able to throw it over. That would have sucked. <laughs> if I had to redo everything. But this one wasn't too bad. Right. Jeez. Well, let's see where we're at. Fourteen one completed. How much energy do we got? Entropy device is eighty one percent charged, man. Yeah, fantastic. Actually higher than I expected. <laughs> Alright. Uh, we can launch over here. Okay. So last thing we need... And first thing we need. Last thing we need is a jump pad. Middle thing we need is another jump pad. We gotta jump from there to there. So we will do this. Okay. to fiddle with it a little bit, but it works. Oh no. Hey, you know what? A win's a win, right? I, I, you know, I got a feeling of deja vu there. Maybe we have done this across timelines. Not trying to alarm you, but the center is three large shockwaves away from total annihilation. I am detecting an extremely large cataclysmic collision approaching the center. Recommendation? Speed. I'm trying. You don't have legs. You don't understand. <laughs> don't have legs. Yet. Stop saying that. It's weird. <laughs> uh, I do want Astra to be able to explore the world just like us. If possible, but that's that. There's a lot of a steps in between that. All right. Well, I've been playing for seven hours, so we're gonna take a little bit of a break here. And when we get back, we're gonna continue trying to save the world. Um, again, potentially for the 
hundred thousandth plus time. <laughs>